At the moment, we're in the exhibition space of the Škoda Museum called Precision, which is dedicated to the preservation of cultural heritage, the preservation of historic cars, and the restoration. The exhibited car, the Škoda 422, made in 1931, is in its as-found, intact condition, not tampered with by a handyman. We call it a barn find, pulled out of the barn. It is relatively complete. It has almost all accessories from its era, so the restorer does not have to look for nearly anything and can start working. The restorer can also contact our Škoda company archive. It holds the production records of almost all the cars produced. The archive staff are thus able to find out when the car was manufactured, as well as its body design, its first owner, and usually also its original color and upholstery. After carefully documenting the condition of the car before restoration, it is gradually dismantled, the body is removed, and the chassis and powertrain are disassembled, and then they are gradually restored. If the original shade of paint has been preserved on the body, it is necessary to visit the painter and get the correct shade mixed before removing it. Today, few people know that until the 1950s, wood was the essential building element in car body production. Therefore, the restoration of the body begins with a carpenter, and only then panel beaters enter into the process who try to save the sheet metal parts of the car. Sometimes during the restoration process, the part is so corroded that there is nothing to be saved. In that case, the panel beater must use a sheet metal panel and tools to beat and roll a new panel into original shape. After finishing the sheet metal work, putting the body and chassis together, the painters come into the process and give the car the desired color shade. After returning from the paint shop, it is necessary to rewire the car, fill the dashboard, and fit the windows if necessary. And after other minor assemblies, the car leaves for the upholsterer. After finishing the upholstery, it is time for assembling the last small parts, refreshing the car, and finally, the first kilometers behind the steering wheel.